that's just a $2,000 L I'm going to have to take. <laughs> What's up you guys welcome back to another vlog we're getting started a little bit late tonight because i've been filming all day i'm gonna start with the unboxing because i have all these boxes that have been sitting at my front door because when i come in i just leave them right there at my door so i need to finally open them this is what i have right here I have these, one that I started to get into, and then one over there that I opened. I opened it because I was so excited because I could feel what it was. I think this one is um, the vase that I was waiting for, for that pompous grass over there. So what I'm going to do is put that together. what it looks like um i don't know how i feel about it i'm gonna show you guys where i wanted it to go um i don't really know how it's gonna look but let's set it up don't mind the clothes in the background on my couch i'm packing right now but so this is where i got it to go like i don't know if that's it let me put some of this stuff in and we can see what it's looking like so this is the pompous grass that i got see i don't even know if i like this pompous grass because it's just not as full as it looked on the site but i'm going to use it to see how this is looking because um oh hell no look at this look at that okay i'm gonna need to put some paper down there it doesn't matter that it's thin because i could always order more like it wasn't like super expensive but i'm gonna stick some paper down here so it could be higher and look it's hard to put the paper down like y'all i don't know about this Okay, at least it's kind of sticking up now. I feel like, let's see what everything else is inside. These have to be fluffed up, of course. I don't know, y'all. It needs something right there in that corner though, but I don't know if that's it. <laughs> I already knew I had to fluff them out because I already have some up there, but look at how fluffy these are. I got these ones off of Amazon and then, but I did want these to look different because you know, just to add something. Let me sit down. Do I like these? I mean, I, I mean, it's cool. Like, you know, like, so I could take my selfies. Like it has something going on. Uh, I need to sweep up and like, see like exactly how it's gonna look but i mean it doesn't look bad and these flowers don't really go here what was i gonna say oh i haven't really found the stuff that goes on this table or this i still need to fill up this bookcase as well but you know i'm slowly getting stuff done i'm not really really focused on the little things yet because i'm trying to get the big things done which is like painting my bathroom still and my room because if you guys haven't noticed that still does not match my living room um but that's where i live that's where i'm live at you know that's where i mostly am my bathroom and my bedroom so it's kind of hard to just be like okay i won't go in there for days you know what i mean so i'm trying to figure out the perfect time for me to get that done because i probably will not want to be here 
Um, but yeah, I guess that looks cool for now. I'm just gonna leave it. You know how you have to um, walk past things for a minute? I'll show you guys again after I clean up over here, like get rid of that box and kind of sweep up because that stuff gets everywhere. And if you guys, I don't think I've ever showed you guys my mirrors before, but these are new mirrors. I used to have two mirrors that I bought from Overstock um, that were $1,000 each. I got them hung up and they broke. I don't know who to blame. I don't know if there was something actually wrong with the mirrors because they like completely like bent and broke at the top or it was the people that hung the mirrors because the people the people who um these are custom mirrors they like custom came and measured them and they put in the um plug like when i had my other mirrors when i had my other mi mirrors they um that plug was covered so they came, they did a really good job. And they also put the um, new mirror up in my guest bathroom because the mirror didn't used to go all the way across the wall. So yeah, I'll show you guys that another time. They said that those two um, overstock mirrors were hung wrong and that's why they broke. But the people who hung them said that they think that there was something wrong with the mirrors. <laughs> So I'm like, I don't know who to blame. So I don't know who to get my money back from. But yeah, so if I do get it back, that's great. If not, that's just a $2,000 L I'm going to have to take. Okay, so that was one thing. And I got that vase. You know what I don't like is the paper that I stuffed down. You can see it. I might have to go put all white paper in there. Cause I'm looking at it and you can see all the paper that I stuffed down on it and everything is on it. Great. Okay. Well, whatever. I'm gonna have to deal with that later. So first, um, I got some towels and these are hotel towels, which I love because I kind of, that's what I kind of base my bedroom and my, uh, bathroom. Like I want it to feel like a hotel, just like clean and, cause I'm in the middle of like redecorating my bedroom and my um, bathroom. And, but I always felt like I loved the feeling of being in a hotel. I don't know why, just, cause you know they bring you new towels and it's just new and white and clean. That's kind of like what I like my bathroom to feel like and um, my bedroom. And you know, kind of like empty. So, um, anyways, I just got some new white towels and they're just basically like the white towels like at a hotel, kind of big, really big. So they can wrap all the way around all of me. And um, yeah, and I think I'm gonna do something real cute, like um, put towels, like roll them up and like put them in a basket. I don't know. When I get there and think about that, I'll let you guys know. But, um, so I got those. I have this big box Ooh, that probably has a bunch of things in it. And I don't really, when I order stuff, sometimes, sometimes I don't remember what I get. So when I see, so it's like a surprise sometimes. I'll be like, oh yeah, I did, um, I did order that. Okay. What the hell is this? Oh. Oh, this is just meal prep stuff. Meal prep. I don't know why they are wrapped like this. That's weird. Um. Oh, some uh more eye drops. Cause y'all know I just got LASIK, and these are the eye drops that they're putting in my eyes. So I just got some more of that. I got some new spatulas. I, I did not order these, but okay, I ordered this one. Because the other spatulas that I had, they were like black as well, but they were kind of getting like that ashy look and I don't like that. I need my stuff to be looking nice. So I threw all that away and I started ordering some new stuff. Actually, I um, already got the spatula and stuff that matches this. So I already put it away. I'll just wash that later. Like this box, I don't know what the heck is in here. Cause it, I don't even think it's an Amazon box. It does not say Amazon. Oh, 
Oh, this is closed, y'all. I wanted to show my house stuff. I thought, I don't know why. It's, ooh, it's just some Yeezys. Wait, since that's some shoes, I'm gonna go ahead and open this. <clears throat> this box, this is from Zara. This is just a, I already know what it is. It's only one thing. It popped up on my Instagram and I just thought that it was so cute even though like winter time is pretty much over. Well, about, well it's not over, but you know it's about to be over in Vegas. But it was so cute. I just love the color because this is like the color that I just am going to try to base my wardrobe on. And it's just a nude, um, Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at this. Oh, oh. Lord, okay, I'll clean that up later. But um, yeah, it's just a nude long puffer vest. You know, like, this looks like I'm about to go get Starbucks. Just kidding. <laughs> but it's so cute. I love it. I think, you know, with like a black, um, I don't know, this is cute, okay? Like, you know, like a cute black sweatsuit or that's tight and fitting, or like um, a tight bodysuit underneath and some boots. This is cute, because right now it's giving me huge, but that's why I gotta do like a something smaller underneath. But yeah, so this is um, one thing that I got. I'm gonna go hang this up. I haven't been to or um, ordered from Zara in so long, but um, they usually have like little cute finds. I, every once in a while, you know, when you go in there, I've never gone in there and not found anything. Like you find one thing. That vest popped up on my Instagram and I just thought it was so cute and I had to have it. So I got it. Now, this is another box from Amazon. So, I got three of these Miracle Curls cream pudding from Ozzy. So, the first time I tried this was at my sister's house. This is what she puts in my niece's hair um, with the curly hair. And so, I was using this the whole time that I was there. She bought it and thought that it was like a deep conditioner, but it's like gel. It does not, let me open it for you guys. Like, it does not look like gel. It really is, it looks like conditioner and it smells so good. But it holds like, I don't know what. Like, this is like, that's why I bought three. Because I know I'm gonna use this. Like, it really just lays your hair like flat. Like, sometimes even like my edges, sometimes they'll like puff up and get all, you know, just not laid anymore. And this, all I do is put a little bit on it and it just holds throughout the day. I will say there is some flaking after you, um, well, like with any gel, like after you get home and, um, you know, like brush your hair or whatever, it's flaky. And I got this, which I'm so excited about. This is a um, PMD for your body. So I have the one for my face, which is like, you know, it's exactly this, but smaller. So it has like this part, and then it also has the loofah, so you can kind of like reach, you know what I mean? And then it has the um, polish for like your feet, so you can keep them super soft. So it, I'm guessing it rotates. I haven't used it yet, but the other one, it pretty much just vibrates, but this one, I don't know, since you change the heads, it might do something different. So it has that, the loofah, the polish, which I'm excited about because I like to keep my feet super soft and they get dry in Vegas. So, and then it has the um, massager piece. This is the last thing. And this is those pants. My sister said I don't need to get these, but <laughs> she got some as well. And I've been seeing them everywhere online. They're those, um, you know, like the scrunch booty workout pants. And they're supposed to make you look real good. I don't know. I'm about to try them on for you guys real quick. Let's see. Yeah, first of all, it all it do is it feels like you really got a thong on because you know how it like goes in the crack 
<laughs> I didn't mean to say it like that, but it really, you know, like hugs the booty. So it's supposed to make your booty look real good. I don't know how often I would wear these because they're not really that comfortable. But if you really, really want to make your butt stand out, I guess you might like them. You see how you can kind of see the paper a little bit in there? I'm gonna fix that. But let's back up, bag it up, bag it up. Let's see how it's kinda looking. I don't know. You gotta look at everything as a whole. So I just made my tea. I'm about to get ready to lay down and watch Housewives. Yeah, I'm gonna call it a night because I have to wake up really early to go to the gym in the morning. And also I have, um, someone coming by to um, look at my bathtub because I'm gonna get my bathtub reglazed and like the jet switched out and everything like that. I've been waiting on that to um, before painting because you know, if they have to do anything like serious work, I don't want them to, you know, be dragging in stuff and messing up my walls, newly painted walls. Oh, I don't know. Let me give you all one more angle, hold on. Cause I'm looking over and that's what I'm seeing, so. I don't know, y'all gotta be here, okay? So if you're ever in Vegas, no, I'm just kidding. So I'm not doing too much in there. Like I'm not really changing out anything big, like the bigger changes that I made around my place. But um, I do wanna redecorate. And same with my bedroom. I'm. It's pretty much gonna be the same furniture and stuff, but um, I think I'm gonna get a new bed though. I think I'm gonna change out my bed. I'm not sure, of course you guys will know, but um, I want to also, everything, I do want to do a um, a tour, like I always say in my videos when my place is finally done. I wanna do a condo tour just so I can show you guys um, where I got everything. Cause I know exactly where everything, well, I don't know about every little thing because I did start doing this before I had a YouTube. But um, when I see people do tours, I love when they tell me exactly where they got, got it or can lead me in the right direction, you know, to find it. So that's exactly what I'll do. Like most things, like looking around everything, the big stuff in my place, I know exactly where I got it. So I'll be able to lead you guys into um, finding some cute stuff. But I'm about to go to bed and I'm gonna see you guys in the morning because I'm tired. I'm a little bit tired this morning because I'm up a little earlier than usual because I have someone coming by to fix the cartridge on my shower or something like that. I'm about to go to the gym, of course, before he comes. So that's why I'm up earlier. I have this little set on. I got this from, um, from Joy in Life. It's super cute and it, if it's good, it's like, you know, how the high band, it like keeps you like your waist super cinched in. I did tell you guys I didn't really like those um, pants that I got from Amazon. I'm gonna still wear them, but you know, they weren't my favorite. My voice, <clears throat> I sound a little like, watch well, I'm stuffy every morning because I have allergies and I don't know, the morning is just the worst. But I'm about to take my shot. I have to go to the dentist and get some stuff at the store. You know, I want the gym to be done because that's the first thing I need to get out the way. That was a spicy one. So I thought I was gonna be cleaning up and like doing the dishes and stuff, but I didn't realize to fix my shower, they had to turn the water off. So the water's off. So I'm just in my beauty room and I'm cleaning up because I did do the five minute makeup challenge and I made a huge mess. So I'm just gonna clean that up. And I wanna show you guys the progress that I'm making on my clothes. All of this is to give away to like friends and people that I know. And this rack as well. I have already, um, taken probably about five bags to Goodwill. And then I have two more right here that I wanna take. Um, there's also more clothes that's gonna be going on these racks, but like I told you guys, I was um, going to like do like la any lash try on and just seeing if I really wanted to give it away. And I did that last night with my pants. And of course 
I tried it on and it's just not with what I'm trying to go for now. Probably 10 more pairs of pants that I'm gonna put on these racks and I still have to go through everything else that I put in there just for a last try on. I only went through the pants. So far it's looking good. I'm trying to like color code it so it's easy when people just come over and look through and whatever anyone doesn't take, I'm just gonna take to the Goodwill. So that's what I'm gonna do right now until they're done doing my shower and then after that I can head out and start running errands. I also have to go to um, a pool place today because I'm getting my, um, so for my shower, it was just leaking and they said that it was the, um, knob like it wasn't turning all the way off so they had to go in there and whatever fix the cartridge if y'all know what that is i don't but um so it works and it turns off for my bathtub it's a jacuzzi tub so i haven't really used the jets in a while because one time i turned them on and it was just like it like made the water weird so i was like Ugh. I don't know what's going on but um i called the guy and he was like oh you're just supposed to when you have a jacuzzi you're supposed to clean out the jets with this certain solution so i have to get that and he's also going to come back and repair um one of the jets and then after that's done i'm going to be getting my baths um reglazed i think i'm going to go ahead and do the guest bathroom too just because I don't know just to make them brand new again so like reglaze is when they like repaint the bathtub and make it like shiny again and brand new so if there's any like marks or cracks like the um jacuzzi tub in my room there's like a crack that's always been there since i lived here like i never knew that you can get that repaired until i started doing like work and googling and researching stuff while i was getting um work done in my place so i was like let me get that done because it's always bugged me and I want the bath to be looking new because I love taking my bath. So I was just like, I might as well get the front one too since I'm already going to get that one done. And it's not too expensive. Um, for my bathtub, it's like $500. And then, um, so this tub is smaller. It's still a big ass tub, but I think it'll be cheaper than $500. Right, so I just got out of Target. And it's one o'clock, but my dentist appointment, which is right up the street, is at 1.30. But I don't want to go this early, so I want to try and find a pool place, but then I might be pushing it. And I still want to get my car washed. I never got my car washed. The, um, the last vlog I was saying I wanted to get it washed because I just got my car. Um, they fixed the wrap and they also changed the bumper because the bumper was like, I had like a black line and I just decided I didn't want that anymore. I just wanted it all the um, cherry, whatever color it is. I wanted it all the one color. So they took that black line off and they also fixed the little pieces that were sticking up and yeah i'll show you that because i really really need a car wash but i had to wait three days so it's been the three days but if i go get a car wash right now it won't be done in time oh there's one one mile away it smells like chlorine no bulbs you don't need bulbs they're already doing that i don't know what i need so do this one right here okay this one okay so what exactly do i do now it's a jacuzzi tub, so it's gonna have less gallons. I would probably do half of it, roughly. So fill it up halfway? No, or fill up just... your whole thing and then your whole tub. Uh, above the half jet. of that, uh -huh. it's, you're gonna see some stuff starting to come up in there. But okay. the pool place was, um, was right across the street from my dentist, so that worked out perfect. And I'm about to walk in right now. Swish that and spit it back in the cup when you're done. Okay. It makes people not care. They're so About the relaxed, pain. yes. They don't even notice what we're doing. Now we can use both. We can use topical anesthetic and nitrous. Yeah, it is freezing today. And I stopped to get some gas, but um, because I'm about to get my car washed next. Um, the dentist. Man, I already told you guys before, I do not like the dentist. My teeth are sensitive. And so this time, it was only for a cleaning, but that even bothers me. So um, she's like, okay, for next visit, you're going to have to either get numbed or have laughing gas or something just so I can get to those sensitive teeth. And my teeth that are sensitive are right in the front down here. 
I don't know what it is. Um, it was actually from, I've got one professional whitening in my life ever. And it was like, I don't know. I literally just graduated high school. That was the first time and the only time that I got my teeth whitened. I can't even use like the out of the store stuff. Like it just bothers my teeth. So it just made them sensitive. And my teeth been like that ever since, which has sucked because it makes me hate the dentist even more. But I don't know what I'm going to do. I've never tried laughing gas. I've had the shot, you know, where they numb your mouth before. But like today, I did not feel like doing that because it's, I'm like a cleaning goes by like that. And it's like I have to get numb, have my mouth numb for three hours for that. Like, I'm not feeling it. So I'm going to show you what I changed really quick. See down here, not this, but right here from all the way over used to be, it used to be black. And I just wanted it all the same color. So that's what I did um, the other day. And it came out really good and I like it more. They did exactly what I wanted. So yeah. All right, so I'm about to try and clean out my jets with this stuff that the guy recommended at the pool store. And I believe this is what I'm supposed to use. He said, put half of this into the bathtub. So I gotta fill it up and then let the jets run. He said, it's probably gonna look nasty because I guess, um, you know, like using oils and like bath salts and all that kind of stuff because I do use Epsom salts, all kind of like all the bath stuff. Rarely bubbles. Like I don't put bubbles in often because ladies, you know that um, bubbles isn't really good, you know, to have down there all the time. So bubbles is a sometimey thing when I want to be cute. Ew. It said to let it run for um, five minutes. Ooh, and it's perfectly six o'clock right now. So at 6.05, that's when I guess I'll stop it. He said if the water doesn't look clean to do it again, but I can't even see. Like, it's so much bubbles. Maybe I put too much. I told him jacuzzi bathtub, but maybe he was thinking it was like the jacuzzi, like a real one. It's starting to overflow. So I turned it off, but I'm scared to turn it back on. It's about to come over. Yeah, for jetted tubs, it says use half of the bottle. I don't know what's going on, but every time I press the jets on, this is what's going on. Like, and it's thick, super thick. If foaming becomes excessive, turns jet. Oh, my bad. The foam is very much so excessive, so I'm just gonna let that go down and we will come back to it. So I'll probably take a shower and then... <laughs> I guess I'll take a shower and then come back to it because it is getting crazy. Good morning, I just got back from the gym and I'm about to, I'm gonna do a couple meal preps really quick before I get in the shower. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna be making. I'm kind of just using what I have. Before that, let me show you guys how my bathtub turned out. I thought I was gonna see a lot more come up, but I mean, I mean, it's some stuff that came up. Like, look, all this, remember the bubbles came all over? Like, I mean, it is kind of nasty, but. Now my cleaning lady is gonna come over like, what the hell? So now um, I guess that's just gonna have to get cleaned out and then he'll be able to fix the jets because they purged. I got this new tea from um, Target yesterday and it's the elderberry blackberry. I'm probably super late on this. I probably should have been drinking this a long time ago, but this is my first time seeing it. So I got this. I'm gonna see how it tastes today. I've also been thinking about how I'm gonna do my YouTube videos. The vlogs that I watch, they're like an hour long, but I don't know if anyone really wants to watch me that long yet, but it's like an hour long because it goes through the whole week. And usually I don't really vlog like through the whole week. It'll be like a couple days and then I'll post that because I wanna keep it short. Cause I think people like to see 
I'm thinking people like to see something short and I have to wash my hair because I'm starting to get the flakes. But then I hear some people say that they like the longer video so you can sit down and watch it. And I'm still like super new to YouTube. So I'm still trying to figure out like what people really want to watch from me. So, um, yeah, I don't know. But my most popular videos are vlogs. So I do know that I'm just trying to figure it out. I think this next week after this um, vlog, the next one I'll try to do like through the whole week. So it would probably be today is Thursday and I'm gonna end this vlog today because I'm going to post it tomorrow. So my vlogs will probably be from Friday to Thursday. Next week will be a lot busier though. So it'll probably be more interesting. This week wasn't, you gotta understand like, I'm a normal person, so my days aren't like jam packed crazy every single week. It's just gonna be like sometimes chill, but I'll just still try to show you like what I do every day. And I need to post those um, photos on Instagram that I did in my last vlog. I have to post those today because they finally got back to me. I was wondering like what was up because I emailed them that night, which was like a week ago. And, um, you know, I didn't hear back, so I'm like, uh, is this the right email? I'm not sure. But then when they finally, um, got back to me this morning, they they liked the pictures and they're like, post them um, as soon as you can. And they like the video. So I'm gonna post both of those things today. So make sure you're following me on Instagram so you can go like my photo. <laughs> Let me know in the comments, like, do you guys like long vlogs or do you guys like short vlogs? Do you like sit down videos better? Like, I need to know, I need to know so I can try to give you the entertainment you want. Some videos, obviously I do, do just for myself. Like sometimes when you're creating things, you just want to do something for yourself and see if they like it. If you don't, you don't. And that was that. I'm gonna get my morning started. This will probably be in the next vlog because I need to edit this and get it up for you guys for tomorrow. So that's the end of this vlog. And I thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys in the next one.